we have certain free electrons in a plain copper plate that somehow get shifted over a small distance x at right angles to its surface as a result surface charge and corresponding restoring force emerged giving rise to so called plasma oscillations find the angular frequency of these oscillations if free electron density is given to us so he has not uh, clearly explained but of course these plasma oscillations are performed by these free electrons only and you can imagine when the electrons will shift electric field will be developed inside and that electric field will cause these oscillations so let's say this is our plate and let's divide it into these two volumes at the end of the plate of width x so why we are doing that because the element the electrons get shifted by distance x so here right now before anything happens electrons are evenly distributed in this whole volume now suddenly the electrons are shifted right by x so you can imagine that all the electrons in this region in this b region will come to this surface a so a is just the area basically they will come to this right surface so all these electrons in this region will get collected here now all the electrons are shifting towards right so in between the density of the electrons will remain the same on the left region however all these this whole region will be devoid of electrons because all these electrons have moved towards right so on the left side will have lot of holes so they will not be on the surface but they will be evenly distributed in this whole a volume on the right side however these electrons will be on the surface and these number of electrons will be same as these number of holes so electrons are shifted right by x therefore a region will have no electrons and b region electrons will be collected on right surface so now let's take one of the electrons in the in between region so the force on that electron will be ee if the surface charge density on the right is sigma on the left side it will become minus sigma and plus sigma so restoring force is ee and we know because of the sigma surface charge density the electric field is sigma by 2 epsilon so both of them will get added and net electric field in this center region will be sigma by epsilon so restoring force is e sigma by epsilon what is sigma so sigma is the charge per unit area so we have assumed the area to be a so volume of this region will be ax so number of electrons in this region will be ax into n that is n into volume so sigma will be n into volume so these are the number of electrons into e so this will be the total charge divided by area so this is sigma now volume is a into x so we get sigma to be any x so from here our restoring force is e any x by epsilon so of course this comes to be proportional to x and hence the electrons will perform shm so this will be the omega square sorry not omega square this is the force so force equal to kx so this is k and omega will be root k by m so that will be any square by epsilon into mass of electron that is the frequency of these oscillations all right